Okay, so here is the junior commercial doe class. We have Jojo with Abigail, and we have Noma with Calvin. Uh, this was the first time that Jojo and Noma were in uh, a ring, and they did fairly well. Uh, it can be very scary for the young goats whenever they're doing this, and sometimes they don't react very well. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Um, but they did very well. Abigail is still learning how to set her animals. She has a hard time with it with her size in proportion, uh, in proportion to the actual animal. But she is getting better. Uh, the judge was really great. Uh, now, the winner here on the left, she, that little doe, even though it's the same age as Noma and Jojo, she had much, much more muscle uh, build to her and that has to do with their feed and exercise program. I commend you guys for bringing out the young ones out here. It's probably their first show, I'm guessing. Um, I know that's always a tough one. They come out and they have some jitters and it's tough to get them set up just quite right, but I still appreciate you guys bringing them out here and I promise I got a good look at them on the move. Uh, the young lady who's going to start out our class today, I love that she is so youthful and so attractive through her front end. It doesn't look like it when she's set up on the profile because she's a little bit jittery out here for her first time, but I promise you if you study on the move, she is built really well. And I really appreciate about that, that about her and just her skeletal design and overall stoutness is what allows her to win the class. Congratulations. Uh, the young man and the young lady so who are going to come out into second and third are very similar. There's definitely some trade-offs, but I think the young man so in second has a little more genuine rib shape to her, and especially as you look at them from the profile, a little more squareness, a little bit more volume and production value there, especially through the center part of the rib, so that's what allowed her to be second today. Yeah. Young lady so who rounds out the class. She's a really late maturing one out here, and I like that about her. Really extended, especially up through her front end. She's going to turn out to be a good doe, I think, in terms of production. Maybe not quite the amount of natural width at the ground that we'd like to see, or rib shape as we look at it from the top or from behind. But with time, I think she'll grow into that and she'll mature into that. But for today, she's a nice way to round out the class. Congratulations. Okay, so the difference between the commercial uh, doe classes and the market classes is to where the commercial is looking at the body structure of the doe to see how she would fare in production um, as a dam for later on in her maturing life. And then the market is going to be the actual um, looking at also body structure but more muscle mass to see if that animal is actually ready for market as far as going in for slaughter so um, for those of y'all that didn't understand the difference between them um, I hope that helps and um, on the different shows for the boar goats they can be shown as hair uh, or slick and mainly what that means is to where they can go in um, with all their hair to where it's only trimmed a little bit or they can go into where it's to where it's shaved off to a, to a certain length um so uh i hope that helps uh and then as far as the judge she had excellent things to say and so here um are some of the highlights to the show and then some of our weathers that we sold to other kids in our county um, that were in the uh, market class and we did not participate in the market class this year just because um, we had too much stuff going on and we kind of missed the deadline um, but doesn't mean that we won't do it next year <laughs> 